The new ChatGPT image generation update is taking the internet by storm and is producing amazing image generation results. In this video, I'll show you one aspect of it and how you can use it to create print-on-demand designs for Mush by Amazon or any print-on-demand platform. All these designs in front of you, I was able to create and convert from real images or fine and vector style and t-shirt design in a matter of seconds. So let's jump in. We are now inside our ChatGPT platform. So before we test the ChatGPT features, I'm going to show you something interesting here. Press on the Sora icon and this will take you to the Sora.com platform. Even if you don't have it, just sign in to Sora.com using your ChatGPT account and you will log in for free. And this is one of the greatest image generation platforms that can really restyle or create images using the restyle feature amazingly. So if we go, we are now on the images tab on the Sora platform, as you can see on the left. And there are amazing styles and amazing recreations of images using different styles and different characters. And this for example is a funny image that is taken from titanic and this is the prompt that is used extremely hard when blowing on the faces and white open mouth so this is one of the amazing platforms and we're going to use this to our advantage by finding a couple of funny or interesting images that we can convert to t-shirts that are going to sell this image for example here this puppy's subway commute image this is a really funny image this is really interesting and can be used for a t-shirt design so i'm going to press on it and press on the remix button and i'm going to write convert to vector style suitable for merch by amazon t-shirts and add a funny text on it and then press on the remix and this will add it to the queue so the issue is that the platform takes a couple of minutes to convert the images. So, and here are the results. Two perfect designs that can really fit on t-shirts. So, and it, the funny thing is that it add, added its own text. Rough days and working be like a dog. And the style is perfect. Amazing vector style with clean lines suitable for t-shirts for sure and later on i'm going to show you how you can clean it up using adobe illustrator and recraft so let's jump back and try to find some other interesting elements or interesting photos for our designs so what you can do here is to find something funny so this one is a really funny image i don't understand the prompt because it's written in japanese probably but still we can still remix this image by pressing on the remix button and add the same prompt that we added before convert to vector style suitable for merch by amazon t-shirts and add a funny text that matches the image and of course you can create similar real images using any prompt that is suitable for you you can change the settings from here but I prefer to have everything as is and then press on the remix button and as you can see it's added to, to the queue and let's wait for it but while we're waiting let's find another image and I like this image of a cat playing the guitar we can change the aspect ratio from here and then add also the same prompt that we have been using and then press on the remix button and again it will add it to the queue so let's check the results of our previous image and we have two great results it has converted the image to a great t-shirt design that is really funny with nice text this is amazing the design is great the text is perfect and you can just clean it or convert it to vector and update the settings or the dimensions and upload it directly to your t-shirt so and this is what we are going to do later in this video but as you can see the 
restyle feature of the ChatGPT and the Sora and the and the Sora platform is perfect. And this is the results of our and these are the results of the cat image that we have also used. Also great results. So let's do one more thing, one more design using this funny dog image. And again, using the remix button, I'm going to convert to a t-shirt design. And again, I get two amazing results. And even if the text is not matching the design, like this one here, call me old fashioned, it's, you can easily change the text on any other platform. So now let's go to recraft.ai to convert our images to vector because the images that are being generated on Sora are in PNG. So just head to recraft.ai and sign up for free. You have daily free accounts. Uh, you have daily free credits that you can use. So simply press on a new project, import the downloaded images. So once the image is uploaded, just press on the vectorize button and this will convert the image to a vector. And this is, by the way, one of the best vectorizers that I have ever seen. So once the, your image is vectorized, you can see on the left side that the, the number of colors that you it has you can reduce these colors or increase it as you like and if you like your results just press on the export button and export it to your um, the, uh, desktop i'm going to export it in an svg format so that i would be able to edit it on adobe illustrator later on so yeah there are a couple of features on of the recraft platform but this is a subject of another video Let's import the other image of one of our designs that we have downloaded. So let's use this one. Again, press on the vectorize button and this will convert it to vector. So this image has six colors, as you can see here. If you play with the number of colors, you can reduce the colors of the designs, but I will leave it as is. And again, I'm going to export it to an SVG format. Now let me show you how you can do it from inside your ChatGPT platform as well. So once you are inside the ChatGPT 40, press on the view tools and choose the create image option. And here you can either write any prompt to create a new image or simply press on the upload button to upload an image to use it or to convert it to a design similar to what we have been doing on Sora. So I'm going to use this funny monkey image. You can use any image, by the way, to convert it to a design. And oh, so I'm going to upload this image and I'm going to use the same prompt that I have been using on Sora to convert to a t-shirt design. While we're waiting, let me show you what I was able to, to do on ChatGPT platform itself. So this monkey image, this space monkey image, I was able to convert it to this design using the same prompt. And this is the image of the monkey that I have showed you. And this is the prompt that I'm using. I'm just asking it to convert it to vector style suitable for merch by arms and t-shirts. And this is the design that I have I've got. But this time, the great thing is that it converted it to a transparent transparent design png because i added part of the prompt i added a transparent background and this is another also example i uploaded this design and i asked it to create a similar variation of this t-shirt design for the band monkey crew using the exact style but with a different image and using the exact text font. And this is the result that I got. Pretty close design with great graphics and the exact font. And this is really amazing. This is how we can get amazing results using the new ChatGPT image generation and Sora as well. So now let's head to our Adobe Illustrator and upload the vector or vectorized designs that we have converted using Recraft. 
So once the design is uploaded, simply I'm going to select it and using the pad and pressing on the trim button to simply separate or trim the, the vector lines so that I can either cut or remove any color on the background. So I'm going then to ungroup it and remove the background easily. You can also remove any of the black colors within the letters and I can still remove all the black from this design or just keep the eyes in black color but this design anyway will take the color of the background of the t-shirt as the main color so this is one way of doing it so if I place a black background as, as that resembles my t-shirt color it the design shows that the design is, is is being perfect as you can see now let's import this other design and again i'm going to delete the background and to remove these small pieces or parts between the the words or between the letters i'm going to trim the design and then now if i double click on it it, it can be removed easily like so and the amazing thing is that you have your own you have created your own designs that does not match any other design on the internet using AI generated images or any real image. So pure genuine genuine designs out of real images. And of course to export your design just make sure that you export it in PNG format 300 dpi to keep the resolution high and you can choose the folder that you want or you can also change the colors of the design so let's for example place the background in white color to see how the design is going to look like on a white t-shirt and i'm also going to show you how to change the colors or part of the colors or one of the colors of your design easily using adobe illustrator so this is how the design is going to look to look like on a white t-shirt also great and you can see it also on a black t-shirt so let's remove this in here this part so if you decide to change for example the color of the suit of the dog just press on it isolate it and press on the magic wand tool select the color that you want and while the color is selected change it from the color swatch like so <coughs> and or you can use the color picker to pick any part or any area and change its color of course make sure that your design is trimmed similar to what we did before so that all the pieces are separated or are trimmed separately and this gives you the option or the ability to change every port the color of every port separately and here i have a mock-up of a t-shirt so simply drag your design on a, and place it on the mock-up to see how it is how it is going to look like and if, even if you have a complex t-shirt mock-up you can use the mock-up tool the new mock-up tool or in Adobe Illustrator to place the design on the mockup. So to do that, press on the select both the design and the mockup and press on the mockup tool and press on the create mockup and Adobe Illustrator will automatically place your design on the mockup. It understands that there is a mockup and there is a design and it automatically combines them and places the the design on the mock-up like so so even if you move the design it won't go outside the, the mock-up because of the mock-up tool inside adobe illustrator so this was a quick tutorial on how you can use the chat gpt image generation the new image generation tool and the sora platform which is also part of the chat gpt company to generate or restyle any image to create t-shirt designs out of it. If you enjoyed the video, please hit the like button and subscribe for future tutorials. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.